Temperatures are still a little bit on the chilly side, maybe not quite as cold as it was yesterday from the Carolinas down to Florida, but still chilly nonetheless on this Thursday, December 14th, uh, one week from the winter solstice, the beginning, at least the official beginning of winter uh, next Thursday and the shortest day of the year for the northern hemisphere. Now we are going to be warming in Florida and uh, the southern portions of the region as we head into the end of the month, but uh, rain will be developing a little bit farther west as we head into the end of the week and upcoming weekend. Winds won't be quite as strong across the far northwest, but gusts may be approaching 10 to 15 miles per hour uh, through Florida. It could be a little bit breezy at times. And then Hatteras out on the Cape, uh, gusts approaching 40 miles per hour yet as that storm system moves east. As we take a look at the forecast, what you'll notice is that the clouds are going to be thickening up along the Gulf Coast region here overnight tonight and into Friday. That's where we may have a little bit more precipitation potential. At this point, it does look like it'll be in the form of liquid, which is good news. Of course, uh, not too long ago, we were dealing with some pretty decent wintry precipitation, but it does appear that though as we head into this upcoming weekend, more rain will be developing for the lower Mississippi Valley. And that's where rainfall tallies through Sunday morning could be approaching maybe an inch or more. Most of us, though, will stay dry across the region. Again, temperatures will be a little chilly here, uh, but much colder as you head farther north into the um, Tennessee Valley. 43 only in Nashville, 69 in Miami, chilly there, 72 in Orlando with more sun as you travel east.